Okay. Uh, today is Christmas 2012, and uh, I'm out of my shop, and I'm wanting to build a uh, metal art project. And I'm thinking about a motorcycle. So what I've done is I went, went to my shed. I gathered up a bunch of junk, uh, just stuff that I've been saving. Uh, railroad spike. Here's a leg to something. Just, just various junk. I'm going to try to arrange it into some kind of meaningful form in order to make a uh, motorcycle to give. So I'm going to try to video this and hopefully it'll turn out okay. Okay. I found something that looks like a wheel. And uh, these are some old uh, head gasket. Uh, bolts, I'm sorry, uh, cylinder head bolts for a 350 Chevrolet I built when I was a kid. <laughs> Had those left over. And they actually look kind of like a shock. So, let's see what else I can find. Let's see, a big washer, railroad spike. Who knows what that is? Let's see. Keep on. Spark plugs. I think I'll scrap that one. <coughs> I'm gonna start working on this one. That looks like a uh, wheel. I think I'll weld the ends of that. Okay, these are just some. Uh, looks like wheels. I think will work pretty good. These are actually some waste from a uh, some metal that I was cutting from a circle cutter. So. Has pretty cool uh, edges on it. Just weld those up. That's just like a pair of forks to me. I use it as a wheel. I'm envisioning that being the back wheel. And this the front wheel. Something like that. I got the back wheel, some kind of welded up a little bit. Let's see. Maybe it'll be like uh, something like that. Yeah, it looks something like that. Again, all I'm doing is just taking pieces and putting them on there, welding them, just, and then I lay it out and look at it, eyeball it. Kind of looks like the start of a motor. Okay, just building up my motor. Again, just some different strange pieces I found around. Okay. Just welding some detail on the little motor.
Just like a little motorcycle. You put a tank, seat, fender, and a bars. Well, I wasn't too fond of this back wheel, so I got some one inch washers. We grouped them together, and uh, I had an old uh, bearing that I put in here. What I'm going to do is uh, I just tack the bearing to these, put a little bead on the inside of the washers there, we'll run this through as an axle, and tighten it up, and we'll have a spinning wheel, I think that looks a lot better too, anyway, slowly but surely it's coming we'll together, a little crossbar on here, and a little headlight, the tank I took a piece of uh, stainless steel and uh, notched it with my grinder <coughs> and then re-welded it uh, so let's see should fit something like that okay yeah that'll work that will work Now that I have the basic frame built, I'm just adding different uh, little nuts and bolts and uh, just various things that I'm finding. <coughs> like, for instance, this little piece right here looks kind of like a Harley emblem, and that's just the head of a, a thumb screw. <laughs> Well, I think this is about it. It looks like a motorcycle. It's uh, made of scrap metal. It took me about uh, eight hours to do this stupid thing. Though. But it's a fun project. Um, so basically, you just start out with your frame, uh, build you a frame, and then start adding uh, different pieces to whatever looks right to you. And uh, let's see, you can see the ball bearings inside here. Wheel turns. The front wheel turns. And it sits upright. Anyway, that's the basic procedure if you wanted to make your own uh, metal artwork slash chopper. Thank you for watching.